Oh, it is a total celebration today. And we're celebrating. We're celebrating Madiba. We're celebrating what we can achieve as a nation when we come as a collective together. And to do that, we're going to be making something delicious. Oh, yes. We're making Utata Mandela's favorite meals. Oh, across the morning, you're going to be seeing them. Now, among many, one dish that we had to try was absolutely, without a doubt, the oxtail dombolo or the oxtail with Dombolo, deliciously succulent oxtail with soft and fluffy dombolo. You know, all slow cooked to perfection with the help of B. Wells canola and olive blended oils. And this recipe is a great way to come together, really, and remember, you know, Udata's legacy with a comforting meal best enjoyed with loved ones. And, oh, chef, my chef. Chef Sims is in the house. How are you doing? I'm all good on yourself, guys. Very good, very good, thank you. I mean, look, you got my full attention. When you said <laughs> oxtail, I was like, <gasps> and then you said ah. dumbbell, I was like, I'm there. I know, everyone, everyone loves this. And yes. it's very nice to know that that was one of this, that was favorite dish. I mean, yeah. and it's a nice hearty meal. So this Lisa. can be done on a nice Sunday and everyone can share it and it's lovely. It's a lovely I do dish. love that you mentioned that people coming together and people being able to share it. Okay, let's go through our ingredients. Uh, it doesn't seem like a lot for such a hearty, wholesome meal. Take us through it. Oh, it's not even that much, hey. I mean, yeah. the real components, of course, you need some oil and uh -huh. lovely, be well. You've got our You've be well got, canola and olive oil. Mm -hmm. You've got your preparation, which is always the three. Yeah. Onions, celery, carrots. Okay. You've got some oxtail mm -hmm. that's already been browned. Uh -huh. You've got your stock, stock. some crushed tomato, and some non-alcoholic red wine. Okay, stuns, hands. And then you got some, what is that, spice? Oh, these are all the spices. We add a bit of, I'd like to say it's a mix. I can't yeah, tell you can mix your spices. Yes. yes, and then some garlic and of course some flour just to thicken it up. Fantastico. And on your side over there, you're going to be making us if dumbo. All right, where do I start? Okay, you start with flour goes in flour first. Flour goes in first. Is that how you always must start? Because yes. you know what? I've, I've, I've experimented quite a bit. Sometimes I go water and then flour, and then the flour is like sitting at the top there, and then oh, it's clumpy no, no. and lumpy. Hey. Oh, you Oy. see? No, no, wait. Before you even put the water, okay. sugar. OK, you see, this is it. We're learning. This is a master class on dumbbell making. Uh, sugar going in, great. And followed by your yeast. OK, and then our yeast goes in there. Now we're going to be then, activating yes, everything. Are. The so yeast. going to wake up. Mm -hmm. We're going to get to work. Great. So dry ingredients have gone in there. Our water, perfect. While you go, where I'm do gonna, you go? Uh, yeah. First thing you do, of course, some oil in your pot. Mm -hmm. About a teaspoon, maybe two. Once that's hot, I've already preheated my, my pot, so it's already sizzling for me. Uh -huh. Toss in your onions. Great. Toss in your celery. Celery goes in. And then toss in your carrots. Fabulous. Okay, great. Well, we've made use of our Be Well canola and olive blend as well. I love that it's a blend, okay? It's the Be Well canola combined uh, with that taste of extra virgin olive oil to produce a versatile blend with a beautiful olive taste profile. It really does come through and it stretches. Now, the blend has a high smoking point. It drizzled over salads, it's great for that. You can sizzle it in the frying pan. Uh, the versatility does make your perfect partner in the kitchen. And you're going to see how it does this with our oxtail this morning. It has a good ratio between omega-3 and 6, which is all the good things endorsed by the uh, Heart Foundation of South Africa, which is really fantastic. Now, for this recipe, you can go on to expressoshow.com and you'll see all of the ingredients are listed there. Chef Sim. Yes, yes. Let's yes. go. Mm -hmm. You keep mixing, mixing. We need to start kneading there, actually. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Once it's all incorporated, you need to use your hands, to be honest. You know, you can't <laughs> yeah. do dombolo Are you saying, yeah, no, no, no. If, if you've not used your hands while making dombolo, did you even really make it dombolo? Ah, did you really? <laughs> no, did you really show me it dombolo? When you get in, make sure once that all comes together, all that flour, all that, and then you're going to roll it on the counter uh -huh. into a nice ball, and then you twist it back into there with a bit of oil, uh -huh. cover it, and let that proof. It takes about, uh, on a good warm day, about 30 minutes. Oh, on a great. cold yeah. day, maybe wrap it in a, a bit, bit of a blanket. Yeah and keep it warm an yes. hour, but it still gets the same results done 99% of the time. Do you know the trick of wrapping that around the blanket when you're making dombol and you cover it in a blanket over a blanket over it? My grandmother used to do that all the time, and I really did think it was a bit of a weird thing. And now I understand. Now I understand some Might have been a cold best. day, actually. Yes, you know? that's it. And then that's why. And I mean, when you're doing oxtail yeah. and dombola, it's probably a cold day. It so is probably a cold Goko day. was just ready. She knew. That's it. She knew what was up. I toss in my spices <laughs> uh -huh. and my garlic. Cook that together. 
Can you imagine the excitement of Tata Madiba walking into anybody's house oh. uh, uh, and smelling uh, this recipe coming to life here? I'm now you've got a guest for a couple of hours, eh? <laughs> you've got a guest that's going to sure, be staying. I'm sure he'd sit down and relax yeah. and speak to everybody. Yeah. Everything. What do you think he'd say as he walked in? Like, in your best Mandela, uh, like, say, voice, or impersonation, let's say, we are gay, manje. What would you, what do you think he'd say? I'm sure it'd be something like, oh, gosh, that smells so good. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, and it really does smell so good. Uh, go on to expressoshow.com and get the recipe. But uh, while you do that, let me tell you this. This is great news, okay? You still have a chance to win big with Be Well. Yes, they're giving away 150,000 rand grand prize, and you still have the chance to win your share of 50,000 rand as well. Simply purchase your favorite Be Well product, okay? You buy it, you take a photo of yourself with that product. Uh, how that would look is you pretty much would take a photo of yourself with your any Be Well product, cling, cling, and then you share it onto any one of the Be Well social media platforms, or you can send it on their WhatsApp line, that's 060-582-3678, with your name and your contact number. And the T's and C's, you can find them on the Be Well website. All sorts of recipe inspiration there as well. But if you missed any of the steps, go on to watch this that's coming up right now. Wow, 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 this smells good. <laughs>